Okay, here we're going to take a look at how to use Delta Chat with a chat mail server. This is something a little bit new. It's basically an email server with some special features that enforce encryption, uh, delete old things, that kind of thing. So better security and privacy. So first, you gotta install Delta Chat. This is available on the Play Store, iOS, uh, F-Droid, Windows, Mac, Linux. And when you start it, you see create new profile or I already have a profile. If you do already have a profile, you can restore from backup or add as a second device. And this is gonna let you scan the QR code from the second device to transfer your profile. But we're gonna create a new profile. <clears throat> and notice how much personal information it requires. Very little. Now I can do agree and create profile, or I can use other server. Now with other servers, you can choose different chat mail servers or use a regular email server, which is, it'll work with pretty much anything, except uh, Microsoft and Google have started not allowing standard login protocols anymore. They do that for control, so you might want to make a new account anyway. So you know, let's look at the other chat mail servers. Here you can see some other ones. And a chat mail server is open source, so you can pretty easily make your own. And we can see all the information there. I'm just going to use the default one on 9.testrun.org. And it's going to make one. And then ask us if we want to use a background. And there you are, done. That's all we had to do. But we got to chat with somebody. So let me get another phone over here. And let's add somebody. New contact. And do uh New contact over here. And there we go. Now we're chatting. And we have this uh, green check mark here because what I did using the QR code was uh, transfer the encryption keys through the camera. So it's not going through the internet or anything. This is a counter MITM protocol, which goes against man in the middle encryption key stealing. So that's the best way to make contacts with Delta Chat. And because the chat mail requires uh, encryption, we really need those encryption keys. You can use Delta Chat with your own email server and not use the encryption or not use the enforced encryption, but that's less secure. Still, it's possible. And you can see we have all sorts of things we could do here. Send a picture. Pictures a little slower than text, but pretty quick with a regular text. And we have all sorts of other features too. You got location sharing. Uh, you can set up video calling with a Jitsi Meet server. You know your own again for security and privacy. So pretty awesome. And all this is open source client, the chat mail server, all open source. One thing to pay attention is if you have an iPhone, the chat mail server uses the Apple uh, notification network in order to let the notifications appear on the iPhone. 
So that's a security issue because now Apple knows that you're using this. And that's a requirement on Apple devices. On Android, Mac OS, Linux, and Windows, you're just going to use the standard IMAP idle push connection. So everything will work fine on those devices and be completely private with end-to-end -end encryption. So there you have it. Delta chat with a chat mail server.